first time being in front of an audience on stage with all my clothes on, so <laughs> good. Um, maybe just a little audience participation. Um, so show of hands, if this applies to you, put your hand up, keep it up. Uh, how many out there have a significant other? How many out there have a pet, have a house, have a car, have a license, have more than a dollar in a bank account? Um, all right, you guys are all winning. Um, you know, sometimes if we talk about anxiety, we talk about life and shit, and it's like, you know, really, I learned about equanimity. I was supposed to be at this refuge recovery thing tonight, and equanimity is basically like a Buddhist philosophy that says that experiences don't mean shit. Like, it's what we, what we take from them. So, you know, here I am, and I got this, like, suppose I'm awesome song going on in my head, because I'm a drug addict. I'm a convicted felon. I couldn't do Jerry Judy this week, and I think it was that Hamlet trial. Um, you know, I definitely, my PO, she's like a no-go anywhere I want to go. Um, and I got, like, millions of dollars in debt. And now I got, like, this new shrink I met last week. And he's like, dude, you're delusional. You know, you're unspecified. Like, wait till DSM-6 comes out. Like, how do you have so much, like, confidence? Like, how do you, I'm like, look, here's the trick, man. Give up the credit, give up the money, and, like, your, your roots grow deep. So, um, yeah, I mean, she didn't know where I'm from. I don't know where I'm from. Like, I meet people, and they're like, oh, yeah, where are you from? I'm like, fuck, over there? So, <laughs> sure, I got, like, amnesia, like, throughout the day, every day. And, like, one of the wild things, like, you've been listening to a lot of, like, you know, Nick Cracks and, like, Bill Hicks and George Carlin and, like, you know, these guys, they, like, use the stage as, like, a platform to, like, communicate. So, like, I guess the reason that, A, I'm not naked and, B, that, like, I don't get too nervous is because, like, in my kind of concept of consciousness and, like, subjective reality is, like, dude, we're all in somebody's head. Like, I mean, it's not, like, really a distinction just because we have, like, you know, physical forms and all that. Like, when you're in a room like osmosis, it's, like, man, I just kind of, like, go with that flow. So... Um, I don't know who said that they were going to that after party where we can all be naked, but uh, I think it's just around the corner, so that's all I got. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> all right, that was Tyler. How many minutes was it? Uh, three minutes. No, I was about three on the button. Oh, you you went you ended a little quick. Came a little quick. Yeah, uh, this time. Next time, first time, first time. Next time we'll take up his last 20 seconds. All right. uh, I'm going to bring up your next comedian. He actually hosts his own open mic the last Monday of every month at Writers and Books.